at halftime with 0 0 score. Um, I'm slightly worried with him getting the ball just because his team, uh, I think, can do a lot more than my team can. Um, the fact that I have the ball is forcing him to come to me, which is allowing me to kind of do stuff. Um, they have trolls in particular spots, or really a troll because the other one's worthless. Uh, my pole goer, a couple of the other guys just being in the right area uh, as needed. Uh, so, I'm going to kick off. I'm going to... We'll have low, low kick, I think. Um, you will be here. What about ball and chain go? Ball and chain, ball and chain. He did what he needed to. That's cool. Um, let's see. I think that's how I'm gonna have to position my guys. So the whole idea is that um, I'm trying to cover the tackle zones. These guys can probably dodge around. But it's going to be a little uh, dicey. He can definitely get bigger around my, my guys, but it's, it would be kind of interesting. So I think yeah, again, you know, I'm catching. Yeah. So the reason why he's not up in the line is because I want him away from the tackle zones. I want him to be free so that he can maneuver out as needed. Uh, I mean, he is. He's all about maneuverability, so having him be free out of uh, tackle zones means I can just follow wherever the ball goes. Also, I need him to be the interceptor. As it really has one true catcher, um, it lets me take advantage of it even more. Then, uh, let's see, let's kick it. Let's kick it there. Three, two, one, let's go. Oh! Oh, where's Sky? Oh. Uh, uh, that's, that's okay, I guess. Oh, yeah, his other catcher was down. Alright, cool. So he probably got blocks. This guy's really scared right now. Um, let me see. So I can probably surround him and blitz hard. Uh, I assume he's gonna move this guy either here, here. I wonder if he's gonna take him up there. So the, the problem with that play is that it doesn't really do much for the situation. Um, most of my guys are. You know, six movement, he's going into my zone. So he, right now he's slightly overextending. Alright, so that was a good move. He needed to do that. Um, what he also wants to try and do is probably take down the troll just so that this guy can uh, or push or take down because he wants to move this guy here, thus making this person not move. Um, he wants to. It's mo really important that he limits as much of my movement as possible right now just because that, the only way I'm going to be able to take down somebody is by getting enough guys on there to give myself more dice. Uh, because everyone assists in blocking or tackles. Like 
this guy should have prevented either him or him from moving in. Uh, so right now, I'm going to have to base it off of... Uh, I'm probably going to go on with, with Pogor. I think. Uh, I need to have him... This guy post up here. This guy posts up here. And I'm going to go in through here. Uh, he's in a really good position to score. I really need a kicker. I need a serious kicker. If I had a kicker, I would have a better chance of not kicking it out. Because I think it did roll out. Um, I don't think that particular kickoff event just causes him to get the ball. I could be wrong. It's been a while. Um, this guy's going to probably get knocked out, or he's going to go along the line. Either way, it's kind of fine with me, because he doesn't have any skill points. Um, so, alright, I'm going to move that guy there. Um, I want to move him there. Mm -hmm. Um, and so, okay, that's exactly what I want. Let's hope it actually works. Marcus, don't fail me. Marcus, you're failing me. Today, or just avoid confrontation altogether, as usual. Uh, yes. I don't think these elves are any different from the others. Well, Alright, so that's fine. Um, they seem to play the same boring throwing game as their cousins. No! Fucking dumb. Why is Wyatt the control? Like, let, seriously, this is... But, what the hell? Um, are you, no, you're not going to do anything to him. Alright, so it's my last move, so I might as well take the really risky one. Uh, I'm not really going to force hits because I want them to have to take a chance of being knocked down or have to knock down my guys. I'd rather waste their actions than cause them to have free movement and set up for better blocking and blitzing. No. Not even the 
bulk jump. Sadness. Um, what I do is really going to depend on where the ball goes and how I'm able to assert dominance with trolls. Because if these two are going to be stupid, then I can't push as well as I want to. Especially with chain, uh, ball and chain guy over here. Bribery on the rise. The problem won't be going away. Oh, it's my turn. Uh, let's see. We'll put you here. You here. Um. Let's see. He has a good blitz position too. This might make me crush. Get the ref. His replacement so intimidated that you can easily pursue to look at the way. Oh yeah, now I get a pride. Son of a bitch. I'm gonna give it to you. And you're gonna move up here. Um. All right, so let's protect our guy a bit. And I can't trust my trolls because they might just do. Um, and Ola, the Goblin Lowdown Bats team. In yesterday's Spike magazine, he said that Blood Bowl was like war. The winners just survived. Oh, oh my god. Roman's doing stuff. Nice punch. Right oh, I get out! It's broken now. The <laughs> fighter who fought well could be saved from death by a thumbs up from the pit boss. No such luck for that plan, though. He's dead. Bellman, you crazy son of a gun. Um. Sure. Oh my god! She is probably watching, she will probably be like, what the hell, Bailey? Thank <laughs> you. 